hello everyone my name is ravindra in this video we will see how to add row number in our gallery okay dynamically so let's i do demonstrate to you okay let's we search here in the basis of our country name let's we type g and uh, the country was changed to the germany now you can be see but our row number is also change according to the number of items in the gallery okay the first record is always showing first okay on the basis of this we implemented a this uh, alternate row color in our gallery also okay this step we implemented by using this functionality so uh, how to achieve this okay let's we see first you have to go to the gallery okay go to the items property in the items property i just retype the formula here with function in the with function provide a scope to us so let's we first create a scope here let's type scope you can use any name here okay so for understanding purpose i using scope let's type filter we have to filter our gallery so that's why i use here filter let's we provide the source okay you can be see the intelligence also okay let's we provide source here after that we will give comma and then it asking for the logical test so let's we provide logical state here and let's select our function here so in the from drop down let's we select start with after that we will select column country then we will select the name of our input text input if we provide dot value let's we close the start with function then close filter function then close the scope of our with function then we provide comma then we will use for all function here okay by using for all function we will add this one row here okay let's use for all that we will use sequence in sequence means this filter how number of rows okay let's count this okay so scope so first we will count rows of scope let's we close this let's close the sequence function and we will use patch for adding the row patch here we will use last last function take the last record then we will use first then provide the scope here okay of with function let's close the first one close the last one last function then we will provide comma then we will create a record here row number column we provide here value let's we close our patch function here first we close the record so this patch function so that we call those for all and then with function so you can be see we are just type a formula here so you can be see it here i just zoom it out and also provide this formula in the description box as well so from here you can be copy and uh, let's we go to the gallery's template field here okay and we will use this same formula mode this item a row num here change the row number column you can be see our result let's save the application you can be see here also we have to change the row num column So that's all friends if you have any question you can ask in the comment